Doug here at the AS Show, New York City 2009, here with the legendary Malcolm Toft. Here to talk about his new Toft 16 channel mixer, the AS16. Malcolm? Thank you. Uh, the SA16 is a 16 channel summing mixer. Um, it has no mic preamps, no EQ. The idea is that we've had a, um, a lot of guys say to us, you know, I've got my vintage mic pre's, I've got some great EQ, some outboard gear. I want something that's pristine quality that I can bring everything through to and use it as a conduit, if you like, out to uh, either a stereo buzz or go direct out to my DAW. So that's exactly the purpose of the SA16. Um, so we have a fully balanced line input with a gain of plus minus 10 dB. We have a meter on every input channel which can be switched to read either the channel pre-fade signal or the channel post-fade signal. We have phase reverse on every input and we have a great little feature here which is called the unity gain button. If I press the unity gain button and bring the fader down, the signal stays at exactly the same point as if I'd set the fader to unity. So if you've done a stem in a DAW, you can just hit all the fader unity buttons and bring all the faders down, or leave the faders where they are and the faders will not affect the level. So that gives you a zero reference point for your signal, which is, I think, a really useful feature. Um, we then have on the console, because of course it's not something you can do externally, we have four auxiliary sends. We have two monos and one stereo pair, and you can switch all of the auxiliary sends pre or post. We then have a channel pan, a standard channel pan. We have an illuminated solo on every channel, which is non-destructive stereo. And we have a channel mute. The key feature, one of the key features of the console is that absolutely everything is balanced. So we have balanced line input, balanced channel insert send, balanced channel insert return, balanced direct output. Everything on the monitor section is balanced, such as the um, insert send and returns on each of the stereo buses, the master auxiliary sends, the master bus outputs, the monitor levels as well, the monitor outputs. So absolutely everything is balanced on the console. This gives us an output capability of plus 28 dBm. So we have a really high headroom piece of equipment. Going on to the monitor section, we have of course a long throw stereo master fader. We have a talkback system, so you can talk to the groups and you can talk to the auxiliaries with its own level control. We have um, monitor control room monitor level control. We have a headphone system as well, uh, which of course you can also use as another alternate monitor. So effectively you've got two monitor outputs.